Hello, and uh, today I'll be reviewing the Mega Touch keypad um, for Osu, as the seller says. And um, I found this on Etsy. The seller is Snick. I did not say that right, but all the links are in the description. And um, I've already opened this just to make sure it works, and it does. So I'm just gonna do it for you. So upon opening it, get some packaging, some um, seller information. I'm not gonna show you that in case there's anything on it. And then um, get a bag here, just a USB-C cable, nothing too crazy. Okay, so when I first got this thing, um, just looking at this, I could tell that um, this cable was not gonna be long enough. Um, I think the seller kind of has in mind that you're gonna use this for like your laptop or like portable type of things, but if you're using this for your um, desktop, I think you're gonna be hard pressed to find a scenario where this will reach comfortably unless your PC's on the desk right next to you. But um, I'll get out of here to show you how long it is. It's not that long. Um, yeah, it's not even covering all of my desk. <laughs> and um, I can't really zoom out or anything, so I'll just bring it in. But um, yeah, it's, it's not that long. So luckily for me, I'm a keyboard, um, keyboard file. Sure, let's, let's go with that. Um, so I have a lot of USB-Cs just laying around. And um, I plug that in right here. Okay, I'm, I'm choking. Okay, upon plugging it in, LED starts going. I have a lot of lights on, so it's not too vibrant right now. But um, first thing, I when I got this out of the box, I put it down on my desk, and it started just sliding around. And I was getting kind of mad because I did not want that. So um, what I didn't realize is that there's um, plastic under the feet here and you have to take those off. It was really thin, so I couldn't tell. But there is plastic under there. And um, <laughs> the first time that I put it down, I thought I did something wrong because I could not get it back up. This thing, like I'm shaking my whole desk. It's just, this is really strong. So if you have any worries about this, not sticking to your desk I i'm sorry this thing it will stick to your desk it's really hard to get up and uh you know how i just plugged it in well that that's that's it this is set to um z this is set to x um this is set to escape and this is set to the boss key if you don't know what the boss key does it just minimizes osu and puts it in your tray which is the thing in the bottom right of windows and to set it up you just push it down like that and uh, I'll open Osu. All right, so hopping right into Osu, um, open the settings and key bindings, change keyboard bindings, left click, set it to Z, right click, X, there you go. And um, I actually read on the shop that you can reprogram these to anything you want. I don't know how to do that, nor am I gonna mess with it. Um, it just, it's already convenient for me. So, um, I'm not going to mess with that. But, um, I've already played a few maps with this, and, um, right off the bat, I've already had a lot more finger control and speed. And I actually had to, um, re-record most of this video. 17 minutes of it. Of, like, raw footage, actually. Because, um, I had GeForce Now on, and that made me lag, made it unwatchable. But um, right away, this is the first map. Um, no, this wasn't the first map, it was the second map I played whenever I got this thing out of the box and um, I was just impressed because usually this map, it would take me about an hour of warming up on 220 BPM to be able to do this consistently and with the sack. And I'm not even like, my stamina is not messed up at all. That's awesome. <laughs> I'm sorry if I can't, um, talk well. Um, I usually don't talk and play. I think I actually overstreamed there. <laughs> hey, it's me from the future.
because I know how to make videos. So this is kind of perfect for me right now. Um, I'm moving to a dorm again, and um, sometimes your roommate falls asleep. You still want to play games, um, and you know that Usu is just one of those games that you just can't play. And sometimes, and most of the time, I get an issue by Osu at, you know, the AM's hours. 12 a.m.? Yeah, Osu time. 3 a.m.? Osu time. But I can't do that. But um, with this thing, I feel confident, enu confident enough to do that. Yeah, um, that was pretty good. Um, I've only had this thing for about an hour. Probably played 30 minutes of it. But, um, I mean, it's been amazing for me. Um, there's been no dropped, um, no dropped inputs. No over inputs. Um, yeah, it's been perfectly fine for me. But, um, on the map that I just played, um, my second attempt of using this thing, um, I got a one miss on it, and that would have been 330 pp, which would have been like top 20 play for me at least, probably top 15, maybe more. But um, just out of the box, I'm already almost making plays on this thing. Um, that just goes to show you. But um, we'll get on to the next map here. And um, I hate that I've used this word 100 times, but right out of the box, um, I've had better speed, fair control. And, um, every someone who struggles with switches, I've tried every switch in the book. Um, this is definitely, you know, a good one. Like, if this, this is the best type of switch, and it's not even a switch. Uh, for me at least. But as you can see, I got some scores here. Where I was go, right when I got the keypad. Um, it was my first B rank. Highest stack. And then, um, I already recorded this video. I'm gonna do it again. And I got an A rank. Once again, highest stack and a rank so um that just goes to show you <laughs> um i'm just getting better on this thing and i've only played a few maps but um yeah i'll play this tournament map real quick for y'all Honestly, I cannot be more happy with this thing. Um, probably one of the best Osu purchases I've made. I have made uh, not good Osu pur purchases. I have spent over probably $500 on this game. It's probably the best one so far. And um, as this video ages, I will update the comments. I will tell you if um, key presses, if it starts double tapping, if it starts not recognizing anything. Um, everything will be in the comments below. And um, also probably link my Twitter or something. You can ask me questions there about it if you have anything that I haven't addressed. And um, yeah, let's go over the overview. 
All right, here at the overview now, um, we're going to be going over the pros and the cons of this thing. So um, $45 and um, for just Osu alone, if you don't play it that much, it can be kind of steep. I mean, it's essentially like buying a whole new mouse, um, talking about price wise. But um, I think if you play Osu seriously, you have um, issues with switches. Trust me, I've tried dozens of switches. Um, these are feeling the best and they aren't even switches and um yeah $45 not too bad especially considering um some other OSU things that are out there but I'm not going to get into that but um this is the mega touch um the size is good because well it's the mega um I can't say about the um non-mega one if these are what is on the um, small one um, I don't know about that <laughs> I can barely fit on that hopefully they're a bit bigger than that but um, this size is perfect um, portable clearly um, it's not gonna move <laughs> at all you don't have to worry about that um, took five days of ship that is not bad at all um, I saw some comments um, saying that took them a month to ship but then again those were from a while ago, and I'm sure COVID didn't help with that. But uh, for me, I live in the U.S., it took five days to ship. Nothing bad at all. And to the cons, um, the cable is too short to even um, get this thing comfortable for me, or even get it to get halfway to my computer. And then finally, um, the wear on this thing is to be determined, because um, I haven't really heard of too many... Um, high level OSU players reviewing this or um, OSU players who just destroy this thing and see how it pans out over time but um, once again I'll be letting all know in the comments um, I'll be giving all updates but right out of the box this thing is sturdy um, yeah alright and that's essentially the review so uh, thanks for watching and uh, have a good day